In this video, we are going to solve problem number 12 of 2021, fall AMC 12A. The problem is the following. What's the number of terms with rational coefficients among the 1001 terms in the expansion of x times cube root of 2 plus y times square root of 3 all to the power of 1000? So. Please don't forget to subscribe, turn on notification, like the video. Let's start solving this problem. Okay, let me write here. I can use binomial theorem, but maybe some of you don't know that, so I will tell you a solution that you don't need to know anything. So when this number is to the power of 1000, it is what? We have this term multiply by itself and to the number of them is 1000 x times cube root of 2 plus y cube root of 3 how many terms do we have here if you count all of them it will be 1000 so from some of them i select first one from some of them i select se second one so it will be x cube root of 2. For example, suppose from a terms, we select x times cube root of a to the power of a. Here, the number, for example, how many times the coefficient before that is not important because it's integer. x times cube root of 2 to the a and y times square root of 3 to the power of what? Look here, we have 1,000 terms. If, for example, we select only one x times cube root of 2, the other terms we should select y times square root of 3. So if we select one from first term, we should select 999, 999, the rest. So if we select from a of these terms x times cube root of 2, so the power of y square root of 3 is 1000 minus a. So, if we want to simplify this term, we will see that we know square root is we know square root is to the power of, for example, let me show you, if you have a square root of, for example, w, it is w to the power of 1 over 2. If you have cube root of w, it will be w to the power of 1 over 3. Now here x and y are not important because we want to find coefficients so it will be cube root of 2 to the power of a times square root of 3 to the power of 1000 minus a and it will be 2 to the power of 1 over 3 cube root of 2 to the a square root of 3 is 3 to the power of 1 over 2 1000 minus a Okay, by power rule, we can say a to the power of m to the power of n equal to a to the power of mn. Now, the first term is 2 to the power of 1 over 3 times a, which is a over 3 times 3 to the power of 1000 minus a over 2. If you want to reach a rational coefficient, the powers should be integers. So a over 3 should be integer and 1000 minus a all over 2 should be integer. From first one, a over 3 is integer means a is multiple of 3. a has to be multiple of 3. And from second one, 1000 minus a should be even because over 2 should be integer. So this term should be even so because 1000 is even a should be what a is even or multiple of 2 okay now if we combine these two results a is multiple of 3 a is multiple of 2 we can conclude a is multiple of 6 We know a was power of this term. a is from 0 to 1000. 
So we should consider the numbers between 0 to 1000 that are multiple of 6. Okay, so because a is multiple of 6, one useful way you can say a equal to 6q. And if you replace it here, 6q greater than or equal 0, less than or equal 1000. So if we divide by 6, q will be at least 0 and less than or equal 1000 over 6, which is 1. Uh, 46, 46.6, and so on. Because Q is integer, because A is integer, so Q can be between 0 and 166. So the number of good Qs equal to the answer, equal to 167, and it will be C. Look, there are around 40, 50 important formulas and ideas in geometry combinatorics algebra and number theory useful in amc amy bmo for british ukmt and other olympiad exams if you want to learn them feel free to send message to my whatsapp number in the description and comments and please don't forget to subscribe turn on notification like the video if you had other solutions you can comment below this video. Thanks. Bye.